welcome back to the channel. It's Kitty here. I hope you're having an awesome day. Even though it's Monday, that's okay. <laughs> you're doing great. Anyways, today we're doing another room build. We're actually doing another uh, dorm room build. I've done two so far. You can see them there next to this room because I'm kind of making these like all next to each other. I don't know why. It was just easier easier that way why start on a new lot when you can just continue from what you've done before if you haven't seen those two rooms definitely go check them out i'm probably gonna make like a little playlist for dorm rooms since i think i'm gonna make a few because they're really really fun to do and i love how much detail i can put into each room when they're so small and i'm not building like a huge house because when you build a huge house you don't have like the time to put this much effort into every single room because otherwise it would take like four days to build just one house so i'm really enjoying doing the room builds right now and dorm rooms are totally in right now everyone's doing them so i'm really enjoying doing them as well i've done a girly girl dorm room and a gamers dorm room and today we're going to be doing a musician's dorm room i've got my sim here she's just i'm just testing out that everything works i had a few issues but in the end i tested everything works fine in this room i made the bunk bed and that's what the issue was that you can't put anything under it or your sim can't really access it like under the like top part of the bed so that's a real like a little bit of a bummer because like bunk beds are supposed to save space in your little room but in the sims you can't really put anything under the space under the bed because otherwise your sims are like what is this object in the way i can't use it as you can see sims can use the bunk beds they kind of weirdly just like float up there or like jump up there and use them and sleep in them so they do work i did try not put these like plants and the guitar under there but i had to change those uh move them out so in the end you only have the tiny little desk under here and you have the other <laughs> items in other parts of the room but i really love how this room turned out i was reading your guys' suggestions in the last video as well of what kind of dorm rooms you want to see feel free to leave more in this video's comments as well but i did read them all i'm gonna write them down and i'm gonna do them all as well but th today i decided to do a musician's room and i wanted to do some more color last time the room was kind of like black and white with some blue so today i decided to go with much more color we're using wood like this dark wood everywhere and then we're using green and yellow mostly so I love this room. I think it turned out really nice. And I realized in the last dorm room build, I forgot to put a window. And that is not okay. I think every bedroom should have a window. Otherwise, you feel like you could be living underground. So, sorry about that. I just completely just spaced. I didn't like realize that, oh gosh, there's no window. So, we put a window in this room. These rooms don't like really match together from the outside because they have different doors and different uh, windows. So, they would look a bit weird in like if they were in a building but I just thought I would make every room look the best in my opinion so we went with this long window from Parenthood for this room here and you have the bed here you have the electric keyboard piano thingy that you can play on you have a guitar a violin you've got this dresser here then you have a sink again I like to put sinks in these rooms because I think they're so handy and then what else do you have a bookshelf I think that's pretty much it what you have in this room so you don't have a computer didn't feel like you needed one. You do have the study desk so you can do your homework there and you have a dresser and a mirror. So I don't know. I think it's fine. You'll still have lots to do if you have like musical, musical? Is that a word? I don't know. Sim who likes music, they will definitely be entertained in this room as well. So I went with a lot of earthy tones. Tones. Can't speak. Okay. <laughs> really need to like learn to speak for YouTube videos. But we went with like natural like browns and uh, greens. And then I wanted to put a lot of candles and plants in here. So we have so many plants. And I put candles wherever I could. Uh, we put some shelves. Obviously I love shelves. Especially in tiny spaces. Because they just add so much more surface space. You can fit so much more stuff in your room. I just smacked my microphone. So I really really like shelves in these rooms so I think I'll put them in like all the rooms but we put some more here because why not they're there right next to the door you have a little backpack in here and a lot of items from parenthood like this new I don't know like guitar like inspired wall decal thingy I don't actually what is that what is it off like I don't know I'm so confused now but I know it's like music related now I'm just spacing out what is it actually of but we're using that we're using the new posters as well because they have like a music theme swatch to them and we're using the wall art under the bed as well that have like little 
doors or whatever you have there on the wall. Really like the item as well. So we're using lots of Parenthood stuff still. Uh, fitness stuff pack is actually coming out tomorrow. Seems full of fitness stuff. So quite kind of excited for that one. I'm gonna build like a sporty room next week, I guess, for the dorm room builds because that's gonna be great after we get lots and lots more new like fitness related stuff i'm kind of excited although i'm also gonna build like way more other things with pack like if you guys want to see a gym or a spa or just a house or an apartment let me know and i can do those as well but yeah this room is pretty much done i mean it didn't take me that long obviously it's just a little room it's like three by five or something but i did try to put as much stuff in here as possible like i usually do with these dorm rooms and i really really love how it turned out if you want to download it i will put it on the gallery you can find it under my origin username which is SimmerKittenYT or under the hashtag SimmerKitten which is where you can find the other dorm rooms and everything I have ever made <laughs> basically or posted on my channel Anyways, we are just putting some rugs in. That's a new rug from Parenthood as well. And it had like a guitar print on it. So I thought it was perfect. And then we're using that one of the base game rugs as well. That's really cute. Anyways, here are the screenshots. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. Tell me in the comments more ideas for dorm rooms. And yeah, thanks so much for watching. I will see you guys again tomorrow for a townie makeover since fitness isn't coming out until the evening for me. And yeah. Thanks for watching, hope you're having a great day and bye bye!